Lexus. Welcome along. This is the scene in Riyadh in Saudi Arabia, one of the greatest rivalries in world sport being played out. Referee Martinez Munera handling his fourth Classico. Seven career goals against Real Madrid. He got four in one game against them in days gone by for Borussia Dortmund. Carlo Ancelotti looking for his 11th trophy as the Real Madrid. The, 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 the positions where La Liga put up, Ian, it looks as if Kunde would play centre defence, not right back, because Ronald Araujo always likes to play. Does the Spanish Federation get 40 million euros from the Saudis over to Rodrigo? And then Carvajal. Rodrigo again, that was a chance. He didn't quite get hold of the ball. The whole season. This campaign, halfway through, they've already conceded more than that. So there's questions about this defence, notably when you saw them against Girona the other week and letting in four at home. In football is Gunduan. And a chance straight away for them. They still might get something here. Will it fall to Sergio Roberto? No, it doesn't. Vinicius. He's got Bellingham up there with him. Bellingham goes for this one. Tries something off the outside of the boot, but Araujo got the block in. Bellingham. It's great ball in behind Vinicius here. Heavy touch. Great chance to lead, and that's exactly what Real Madrid do. Vinicius Junior, he wasn't going to mess that up. And Barcelona's defence is caught napping. Yeah, another beautiful assist by Jude Bellingham. Should the goalkeeper have been higher up? Should he have come out? earlier because it was a big touchy and you're right but Madrid play well here they got a bit of fortune there too many to Croach to Bellingham opens his body up they're really high up the pitch aren't they Barcelona considering where Jude is with the ball and then Vinicius does without a goal but has scored in the last two Barcelona games come and get that but he didn't and they've opened up again here and this time behind again it's suicidal Rodrigo Vinicius waiting 2-0, I mean, just awful, too it? easy, just too easy, Barcelona paying a heavy price for some, well, crazy defending, leaving so much space in behind, and Real Madrid, clinical, ruthless. It's like kids football, you can see that a million miles off, no pressure on the ball, why are Barcelona pushing up to the halfway line when there's no pressure? And Real Madrid have got the ball. It's like amateur hour. Look at them, no pressure at all. One simple run. Why are they, why is Kunde and Araujo going right up the pitch? And he, um, fair play to Rodrigo, who's passed me. To pick it up. Torres again with a volley, which hits the bar. And then Lewandowski and a fine save from Union, who's come into the side tonight in place of Kepa. Well, that's the one thing now about the game. Barcelona have to be progressive and have to take chances and go forward. This South. Looking like they could score with... Gunduan Took a deflection on the way through. Falls to Alex Balde. That's a really good ball towards uh, Vinicius again, who... This was Moreno, Craig Burley was saying before the game, didn't know he had that one in his locker. Torres here. Balde's got a few to aim at in there. Just overran it. He's out of position now. And Real Madrid, off they go again. Well, at least Ronald Araujo did for Pedro, but what a great looking ball that is to Torres. Has to go alone. And a very good save, this time with the feet. Vinicius has won this back off. Alohua, there's been a few touches between them. Look at uh, Balde again. Stands one up to the back post. I wonder whether he was going to fizz that. Lewandowski! Oh, that's what he can do. Robert Lewandowski. That's a goal scorer's goal. Sumptuous volley. 2 1. Yeah, brilliant hit. By the big number nine. 
just biding his time, just waiting on the edge of the box, hoping that something will come his way. They move it well out to Balde. You see Lewandowski just on the edge. Sean Maney with the ball in. Penalty. Well, is that going to be given as a penalty kick? Let's see. Vinicius is showing an imaginary yellow card. Barcelona are protect. Scores it. 3 1. Real Madrid 2 in front again. Hat trick for Vinicius Judea. Yeah, brilliant moment for him and his family. Very proud to get a hat trick in the Classico in the Super Cup final. This one was one of his easiest ones. 12 yards out. Runs around the ball, slight stutter, smashes it past Yaki. Three of them look really sharp. It's Fulham. Now they've got to go down to London for the second game on January the 24th, 2.30 p.m. exclusively on ESPN Plus for that one. Fascinatingly poised. Fulham will give in. Does the centre of defence miss Araujo by making him make that switch and putting Kunde over there? I don't know. It's, uh, it's up for debate, isn't it? Mm. A little. Frankie de Jong, chip forward, down by top. Barry, oh, it comes in, Raul get it away, only far as Pedri! Oh, that was not very far away, nearly 3-2 with the last kick of the half. Wow. Barcelona but everything that he's been through in such a short space of time he, in my opinion he deserves a medal for putting up with all the pressures and all the problems he's had to contend with at the Barcelona important financially it's Valverde makes those driving runs with the ball or torn Kharkiv area of Ukraine smooth from Pedri he's clever little Still gets it back off. Kuhn returning up in that little half space. Balde to chip this one forward towards Lewandowski. who was beaten in the air and uh, the challenge incurs the displeasure of the referee. Real Madrid break again. Mistake from Gundogan. Which could be costly. It's Vinicius. And Bellingham. Stopped by Koundé. Carvajal. Koundé got across in the nick foul. of time. It's a foul. Like Chiumani and yeah. Kunde. Yeah, caught him, didn't he? Didn't need to really. Kunde was slow. Mm. That can sometimes work. There has to be an injection of pace somewhere. Pedri. Hungry for more, it might seem as well here. Vinicius again. Got a good angle for those curling right footers. Yeah, they do need something different. Yeah. Torres is playing an hour. Thank you, the young Sergio Roberto. Three midfielders, fullback like uh, Velar Mendy. Oh, really good test. That'd be a yellow card for Rudiger. Yeah. Not the first of his career. But presumably some foul and abusive language. Cross to Vinicius. Nearly, Rodrigo, that's another one. All the goals via Brazil. Vinicius 3, Rodrigo 1, Real Madrid 4, Barcelona 1. And this is just all about pace and running, isn't it? Madrid have got it in abundance in that midfield. Three, four players. And it was Fede Valverde this time, just running off Christensen. Just to set the team going forward that's a nice ball by Danny Carvajal not close enough Christensen allows Fede Valverde to do that plus Middlesbrough taking a 1-0 lead as Laminia Mal tries his luck and got hold of it scored a goal and was named man of the match for Spain against Cyprus as well it's a it's a Ralph Carlton, yeah. Red cars, yeah. 
So he's gone as well. So Barcelona's night goes from bad to worse. He pleads. That little tiny clip is far too quick for Kunde. Bellingham with a clever run. Return. And the classic come Fourth place mm. at the moment. Uh, three points ahead of fifth. Oh, and by the way, Barcelona might not be relishing the for Real Madrid. And there's more problems here for this Barcelona defence. Can they finish it off? Not quite his best. Looking for the one-two around the edge of the box. Here he is again. Big chance. Important save. Lunin's done well tonight. That was a big save. Opened up for João Felix.